All right, train muscles. Let's do this in this part of Let's Play Super Nintendo 2 Dream with your host, Doctor Noise, of course. Let's do this. We missed the first attack. Oh my God, he's more powerful. Ah, he did Rogan Sword. This is the second time he did it. See, it's very powerful. I told you. They usually do it. Well, now they start doing it when they're about. When they're pretty much dead. Two other knights and a ninja is just this thing, okay. And he's still just standing there. Now this place is great for um experience if you want it. So if you want experience, just come here. And I wasn't paying attention to where I was going, I was looking at my wall for some reason, like, ooh, pretty color. Melody over there is fighting an the evil sword, while we were fighting the only knight. Oh, I am taking so much damage. Hmm. Oh, sorry about talking. I'm focusing on you. Like I told you in the first part, when I play these games, I like to focus hard. I don't worry about talking much, sorry. That's how I've always been, ever since I started playing games. It was about when I was four. Maybe, maybe even younger, because I was playing like the early um, Super Nintendo game on the PlayStation game. But when I was even young, we had like a Nintendo system, Nintendo system, Super Nintendo system, and N64, and so many other games too. I, I even remember my, having my own Game Boy Color that I constantly lost in my couch. I don't know how. I, I was just like, ugh. I just, I don't know why, but... That couch was known for losing. Well, I was known for losing my Game Boy Color in that couch. It was lime green, too. It was so awesome. The only thing I didn't like about it was that I had to buy batteries. It was like, eh. That's why when the Game Boy Advance came out, I was like, well, lucky to get it. But then that Game Boy Advance SP came out, then I just said, you know what? Can I get this for Christmas? And I did. And I spent like unknown amount of days playing it by itself. I had Pokemon, I had Mario Luigi Superstar Saga, which I hope to let's play one day. Uh I even had Pokemon um Mystery Dungeon, Red Rescue Team. By the way, the the Mystery Deadly Games, one of my favorite Pokemon um, series. I will let's play it, but uh, I don't know, 
on this. It's gonna be a long left play. Ah, this is the boss. All right. Uh, this is Genova. No relation. No relation to Genova for Final Fantasy VII. Because this one is much easier. For the most part. You can't get a little on that. Well, they're attacking the other monsters. I'm... Well, holy crap, he's dying. And I'll just have, um, Melody... She's not able to be selected. I'll just tell myself to go out. Oh, shit. And she's dead. She's dead. But we still need to be healed, so... Actually, would this count if she's dead already? It won't count for her, but it counted for us. Which is good. Oh yeah, this... I need to be healed of this stupid status element, so... about this boss except for it uses traps and it uses stupid melt wave which attacks everyone. It's annoying. That's all I got here, so also it shoots out these um shapeshifter things. Yeah like that blob there. That shape shifts into multiple enemies in the game that you have not seen yet. For instance, like that frost, frost dragon right there? Yeah, that doesn't come up till like later in the game. There's a spider on my screen, hold up. I got it! And Felix is dead, because he was getting murdered by a frost dragon. A Pakun baby that's coming up in the next area of the game. Well, not immediate, but... The second... The next two areas of the game is going to be coming up. Oh my god, he's just spamming trap level 2 on us. No point in using an angel grab because I'm dead. Told you these battles start be start getting hard, huh? I'm just gonna stay as um Felix. Body change again. And when they shapeshift, they also change their HP that they have, too. Which is easily so annoying. But if you kill them fast enough, they actually do die, thankfully. That brought her max HP down. I forgot what the... I wasn't paying attention to the name of that movie. Is she still small? Like I said, this boss can be difficult. Whoops. Let's go outside the screen again. Where is she? Oh, I can't select her. But she's back on armor. Okay. Alright, you should be good to go for now. 
Oh yeah, that's why they were killing us. They had strength though. This is starting to get more tedious than I thought. Die already! Should have leveled up when I had a chance. Oh yeah, I can kill off the magic too. Did I forget to say that? No. Monsters you kill along with it drops gives experience, which is, of course, good. Let's heal him again! Because... Uh... Uh... I'm hating these points already. It's starting to get annoying. This monster is annoying me! It's also getting hot in here again. I was pressing the X, the B button instead of the A button. Man, I was Will you die already? This battle's been going on for six minutes, probably seven. This is dead. Two. Okay, it's dead, thankfully. Oh. Thankfully, they give us a full heal, too. You can't leave, though. So, if you're in here, bitch, don't do that. I can definitely do that. Uh, I. No. Let's just, um, let's move on because you actually fight two bosses here. The second one can also be very annoying. You fight Felix's friends, Bill and Ben. They become Ninja Master, I think. We also throw shurikens at them that lowers down their hit rate and evade rate. That's the first nin ninjutsu that you will learn. And by the way, I've decided for um, Felix that he'll be a ninja. The reason why this fight is annoyingly can be so annoying is because you're, if you like do enough damage, it splits into two of them. So that means you have two targets now. He's already dead, I think. Oh my god. Let me attack. I'm a ninja as well. Oh, Shadow Guy. That's not good. Oh, that nearly killed me. <laughs> oh my god, he's kicking my butt. This is annoying. This is starting to get annoying. 
Shadow Dive on Hikari. That's I'm feeling inside. Right here. He's dead! We still get experience, even though it doesn't show it. Raising her spirit. I only got you once, I don't care. I'm killing you now. And he's dead! We should also get a metal reward, hopefully. Yeah! This skipped me for some reason, but I'm going to get a level up after this, so it doesn't really matter. I'm increasing her vitality. And then me. Felix, whatever. The reason why I'm saying me is because I'm controlling Felix. Increasing his vitality. Isabella! Oh my god, you harpy. Who the hell is the Dark Prince? You're darn right you couldn't have! Like any of you could take down a boss like that. Two bosses for that fact. By the way, I know how I don't know how to pronounce that woman's name. Did you? So I'm just gonna call her Isabella. For the fun of it. Or I can just call her proper name, bitch. Take your pick. Yeah, please don't ask. That's a special sweetheart! Yay! Uh. Thank you! That, that ought to go swell, right? The two HC already made her mind. For my kingdom, I will find Elliot! And did punch him for getting abducted! Was that a little bit too far? Wow. <laughs> that reminds me of someone from the Secret of Mana games. Um, anyway, this has been Doc Stunners. Any this part of... Any this part of Let's Play Sweet in the City 3. Until then, kiddies, I hope you have a wonderful day. Until then, take care. See you.